Hello, today we're going to look at um, testing an oil pump on a Yamaha 1200R. This engine has been rebuilt. It was a previous SBT engine and it did, didn't last very long for the customer. Um, so we rebuilt it. Um, unfortunately, when we do an SBT motor, we will reuse their cylinders um, because uh, we, we don't interchange the Nicosil with the with the steel cylinders and we think the steel cylinders are a little bit lower quality so um, we use we prefer the Nicosil so anyways uh, we're going to test the oil pump just to make sure it's pumping to all three of these injectors in each here we rigged up a bottle cut the end of the hose and put it in here um, on the end of that nipple so that it will uh, make a nice seal and I can put oil in it and so I'm going to do the bleeding process of it now. So there is a um, a bleed screw right here next to this uh, exhaust mount, and so I'm going to bleed that. We're going to simulate that this is what's going on in your boat. We'll take that out, and right here, there's a little washer on here, a little plastic washer on this tiny little uh, screw. So don't use it lose it I should say because if you do it'll leak all the oil out very slowly we'll just hold this oil up here until we get oil coming out of here and then we know that it's primed and um, I'll just take a minute try and open it up a little bit see if that helps by turning this butterfly here it comes here it comes kind of gently squeezing on this bottle. So yeah, that's um, that took quite a while, didn't it? Just put my cap on, my little washer back there, just gently, I'm just gonna snug it down a little bit. And now we are ready to actually test the pump. So I'm gonna do that with a drill motor. And I have a little fitting here from uh, a 787 oil pump drive shaft, but you can also use the the bolt for that holds the flywheel down on a Yamaha. You can use the flywheel bolt when you have the engine apart. So um, that's because that uh, hits the screw where you can just make a tool. But basically, there is a, a a butterfly on the end of this pump. I'm gonna just hold it open somewhat. Uh, and then I'm going to crank this drill motor over backwards and then I'll check and see if I'm getting oil coming into my which it would be a lot easier with two people but unfortunately there's only one of me hmm. that should be alright Wouldn't you know it, that that is not going to fit. You're going to have to use the bolt. Just give me a second. The other one works a little better on the 787 because it helps it from not popping off of there. So that's why I was hoping it would work anyways, but apparently not. Harder to balance this. Just gonna hold it as fast as I can. Going reverse. And I can see this pipe is definitely pumping. So is that one. I don't have anything to the end yet. Yeah, it's pumping. Lots of oil in there. So, it's looking good to me. Anyways, because I was just curious about it, I was worried about it because uh, the way that cylinder burned down, it definitely looked like it didn't have any oil, but I think maybe the, uh, maybe the line was disconnected. I didn't get to really see it when it came apart. So anyways, thank you very much. Busy, busy.